Hey guys, um, we're gonna be doing a review of the Sledge Fire. Sledge Fire, baby. See it? Sledge Fire. It's, it's just a, a review of the Sledge Fire. Um, now, I love the Sledge Fire, and I, I, don't, I don't know. And I'm sure you can see why. I love the Sledge Fire. And it doesn't sledge fire because you know how it's a three shot thing. It's a, it's a three shot, um, shot. You know, shooting or whatever. It's actually, it's a, it reminds me of the Blundergat in the, in the um Call of Duty Black Ops Two Zombies, Mob of the Dead. You know that map. If you haven't, if you don't even know what Call of Duty is or Black Ops Two, just type in on that little microphone up there and then type in Call of Duty Black Ops Two. Okay, to zombies, um, mob of the dead, blundergat, okay? Or blundergat and mob of the dead, but I think mob of the dead, blundergat, so. Um, so yeah. Um, the sledge fire is really, really good. And it's like, you know, you know the Olympia? That, that, that double wheel shotgun? It's actually kind of like this, but it's like, like this one's a stronger one, and you know, it's like a blundergat, so. And when you pack punch the the Olympia, it's kind of like the the wonder yet. It makes them like turn to goo or just blows them up. Um. So I got a can of ammo right here to fill them up. You know. Eight nine. Okay. Cause. Um, so I have, there's three clips in the back, and that's also another thing, the clips in the back are very good, because actually they don't fall out, you don't need to worry about them falling out, they don't even fall out, they don't even fall out a little bit, um, and before I fill it up, I'm going to talk about the way it looks, you know, this gun, I love the color, I love the color, like a orange blue, you know, and grayish, and that tape, I love the tape around the handle, because also, Actually, the hammer shot has that too. You probably see my review on this baby too. Alright. Just all of that. And this button, there's a button in the back that you press like that. And then you, you hold it, okay? Hold it. You put your hand right here. And you push down as you're holding the button. And then, yeah, see? And you can see there's like these things here to lock it in place. And there's like a shape, see? That's where it goes. And you take one of these clips in the back. Um, okay, you take one of the clips in the back. And you uh, put them in here. But first, before you put them in, you, you put the ammo in. But I'm not going to do that yet because I'm not going to fire yet. Um, so you put it in like that. You can just push You can pull, You can can push it back in place. So you just do this like that. And then you're ready to shoot, see? No, I've seen no bullets in here yet. So. And then you see getting more, you know. Yeah. I love the ham neck. I love the sledge fire neck and nibs them. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna reload it, okay? I'm gonna load it for you guys. So you take one of the clips, you push it in all the way. It's not sticking out, that's pretty cool, right? It just goes in all the way. See? And you actually see the bullets from the bottom a little bit. And then you put it in this this way so it chews off so that way. All right. Now you can see this teddy bear. There's a teddy bear right here. That's one. That's my tar That's my own target. I can shoot at. I don't even have anything up here. So I'm gonna shoot him. See, it shoots all three bullets. It, it shoots all three bolts. Um, it shoots really far, so yeah, um, see that was another one, and you, you can keep, you can keep reloading them, like, you can reload all of them, obviously, so, you see now it's empty, um, so, I'm gonna shoot, I'm gonna fire all three of these clips, alright, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go way back here, 
because I'm going to go all the way over here, or over there where that door is, okay? See this. Remember, you look, that's the, the white teddy bear. That's what, I'm, that's what you're looking at. That's what I'm going to be shooting at. Pretty slick, right? I get that other one because it's full back there and I saw it. Pretty cool, right? Pretty slicky. Pretty slicky. Um, alright, see? That's how Switch Fire works. Um, so yeah. I can put them all back in here just to be ready for the next shot. Remember, and this is also a zombie gun, okay? The sledge fire. It's also a zombie gun. It's not just, you know, whatever. Like a normal, like shooting gun. I mean, you, you could shoot that. You could shoot that bad guys. Like you could make it act like a normal, like gun, you know. But I like to make it act like a zombie gun because it is a zombie gun. First of all, it also sh sh shows you see, it's Z for zombie, and it's like the ar around it. You can see the lines. It's like a sight. It's like a scope sight or something. All right, so that's pretty much it for the sledge fire. Now, before I stop, let's talk about it now, okay? Since I, I shot it for you guys just to show you. Now, remember, I, I love the shape it's in, you know. I mean, it has a really, it's an odd shape, you know, like good. Oh, uh, and I like the stock big enough for my shoulder. I'm just like, do this and shoot the zombies at that window that's over there. Um, and you could also put like a scope or something for a sight or whatever on here. See right here. I thought I, I thought you can put a sight at the bottom. I guess not. So it's, I know it looks like it, but it's not. It's just you know. Um, now, if you want to hold, like, you can hold it any way you want to. You can hold it like this. I'll put your thumb in here and then hold it like this, like a grip or something. Or like that, or like that, or like that, or like that, or like that. I mean, you can hold it any way you want, like this, or this. I don't know. You can hold it any way you want. I mean, like a pistol, too, like this. Or one gun, one hand. Um, and I like the screws. They're fake, obviously, but they made them like... Shoot. Sorry about that. My bullets fell home a bit. Okay, got it. Um, so yeah. Pretty, pretty, uh, cool gun. I love it. Um, like I said, I like the tape right here. Um, and I know it looks like you can open it right here. Like, it's gonna go down, but, or up, or whatever, down, usually. Um, but it doesn't. And on this, on both sides, right, right here, on both sides, it says zombie strike, if you can see that. It, kind of zombie strike, um, and it says nerf on it right here, both sides too again. Um, um, so yeah, that's pretty much it now. Um, the video, you know, for the sledge fire, you can see down the barrel. See, you can see how it looks down there, like what it, how it shoots. I I like how it looks, like around here, you know, the barrel inside, and it's the sight right here, the private sight. Okay, like when you aim, you know. Um. So yeah, remember you you hold the button. You can't just you don't press it like this and then pull it down. You actually because it doesn't pull down. See, you actually gotta hold it, and then as you're as you're pulling this down, you gotta hold it at the same time as you're pulling it down. See?
Go like that. Now, if you don't pull the trigger as you're closing it, and you just and, and you don't pull it, you just do this. It's actually easier. You can just drop it. Like that kind of push it a little bit, I guess. Like that, but. Oh. I like this gun. I like how it opens and stuff. You just do that. Um. So yeah. Pretty much it for the sledge fire. Um. I hope you enjoyed. And I hope you've seen my, uh, like I said at the beginning, I hope you've seen my, uh, hammer shot one. Okay. Um. So, yeah. Pretty much it. So, yeah. And one more thing. You can see, can you see the bullet, bullets down there? Uh, no, I'm not going to do that. Can you see the bullets down there? Okay. Yeah, a little bit, I guess. It's kind of dark, but you can see a little bit. Okay, I hope bye. Anyway, now, bye.